Hey YouTube, it's Mitchell C and I just wanted to come back with an update video for the No Heat Challenge. As you can see, my hair is braided up. I'm doing a braid out where I left rollers on the ends. So I just have four French braids. And what I've been doing is stretching my hair. Um, I have been playing around with wash and go styles but it's been getting pretty cold here in the mornings it's like around 30 degrees or something like that so when I take the kids to school re-wetting my wash and go style is not exactly ideal um, wearing my hair in braid outs and French braids is working a little bit better for me um, I've also been doing a lot of roller setting well not a lot in the last month I've done it twice so what I'll do is I'll do it on my wash day and then I'll wear it for a whole entire week so um, I did it for two weeks and I'll show you the rollers that I use I've just been using um, magnetic rollers and I use the ones that have the snaps on them so since they have this smooth finish I'm able to get like a really um, smooth result on my ends however my roots tend to stay pretty thick after I'm doing my roller sets. I know there's some people who can roller set and still get the roots really smooth, but I haven't been able to do that. Even when I do um, ponytails and then just roller set the part that's left out of the ponytail, my roots are still like really wavy and thick. So the French braid style has been working for me because um, I've got stretched hair that I can moisturize every single day. My French braids look a lot bigger for the updo, and um, and then the thickness doesn't really matter at the roots when I'm wearing French braids and when I'm wearing braid outs, because it's a textured hairstyle anyway. So I'm just gonna go ahead and take my hair down, um, and this is just going to be a braid out similar to the one that I did when I was um, doing my last video, the get ready with me and I didn't actually show when I was taking the braids down um, last night I just spritzed my hair with water first and then I moisturized it with um, my Hollywood Beauty olive cream moisturizer but the Elastic QP is actually working really good too so there's that section I did find out though recently that I don't know if it's just because of um, the fact that it's drier right now. A lot of people put down um, glycerin based products during the winter time because of the dryness and I think that's what's happening with my hair gels. When I do wash and go styles I normally like to use a hair gel to set the curls but um, I don't know that's just not working for me. It's not that it doesn't define my hair but um, I'm just getting like a really crunchy result um, without, I don't know, I just don't have any softness when I scrunch it. So um, I did find out that the Aussie Moist conditioner is working better for me if I do a wash and go style. Um, so I just end up um, applying that while I'm in the shower and my hair is soaking wet. And that way um, I'm able to get a really curly result and when it dries though my hair is soft so I think if I do any wash and goes you know maybe if there's like a week where it's going to be warm and I want to wear my hair curly I'm just going to be doing conditioner only um, yeah because the gel right now I'm still using it to like slick my edges I used it yesterday Pull my hair back but other than that I don't really like it right now for wash and goes. For the no heat challenge um, it's going pretty good so I think you know I've got a nice little system going um, doing the braid outs the roller setting you know it's not my favorite but um, I do like the stretched results like my braid outs are not this big on wet hair but since my hair was stretched out this week with a roller set 
it feels like my hair is a lot um, more manageable and it's a bigger result when I do styles like this. So here's the back. I'm just fluffing it. That's what I've been doing um, this first month of the challenge. And I even started thinking that when the challenge is over, I might just do a roller set and flat iron my roots, um, since that's the part that I can't, tint, you know, I can't get smooth, and just use that as my length check because really I'm getting really great results with the roller sets right now. So this is going to be my look for today. I'm just running errands and stuff. Um, and then I'll be able to pull this into a ponytail or something like that if I want to put it up. But that's just a quick update just to let you know how I'm styling my hair right now. Um, and I am curious to find out how everybody else is doing. Um, for me, I'm not terribly missing the heat right now. Um, I have seen a couple of videos of young ladies and pics on Instagram. Um, naturals who have straightened their hair and so I mean it's tempting but two I really want to wait until the end of the challenge to see you know what I've come up with so um, I'm gonna hold out until the end so I hope all of you are doing well with your challenge and leave a comment in the comment section let me know how you guys are doing and I'll see you in the next video thanks for watching bye